This restaurant is serving up Haitian-style fried chicken. A little onion, garlic, pepper, always delicious. This popular food stop, however, isn't in Haiti. It's in downtown Tijuana, Mexico. Many Mexicans come here to eat every day, and also many Americans come to buy food as well. There are thousands of Haitian nationals in Tijuana. They began arriving two years ago in a caravan of some 22,000 people after fleeing a series of natural disasters and a political crisis in the impoverished Caribbean nation. Denied entry into the United States, many settled just south of the border. Gustavo Banda, a local pastor, runs a shelter for Haitian migrants who continue to arrive in the city. How did they end up in the city? Someone told them this was the safest place to cross the border. One day we gave them shelter and they never stopped coming. This mountainside barrio is usually a first stop for new arrivals. It's known around town as Little Haiti. Yet only a small portion of the local Creole-speaking community actually resides here. A majority of Haitians here are dispersed across the city, where many have given up trying to enter the United States and have either enrolled in universities or started their own businesses. With nowhere else to go, the Haitian community in Tijuana now consists of around 4,000 people. Despite the success many Haitian migrants have found, young people like Wilfred Jean-Louis say it's an everyday struggle. There are opportunities in Mexico, only that you have to be smart. You have to search for your future. Nobody is going to come and change your life. You have to make that change. Many locals laud the way the Haitian community has assimilated to life in Tijuana, adding that it serves as a model for other migrants arriving in the city. Manuel Rapalo, Al Jazeera, Tijuana.